This small gadget prevents cheese from sticking to the cardboard lid of the pizza box. It was conceived 50 years ago by this man. My name is Claudio Daniel Troglia. In 1974, I invented the so-called pizza thingy that is actually called a CEPI, which stands for pizza separator. A native of Buenos Aires, Troglia and his family shared a profound love for pizza. But with each purchase came a problem. In 1974, pizza boxes were not made of corrugated cardboard. They were made of very thin cardboard. So pizza makers would put about 10 to 15 toothpicks on the pizza. But by the time you got home, the toothpicks had toppled over and were embedded in the mozzarella. Sometimes you could be eating the pizza and suddenly get stabbed by a toothpick. After a bit of thinking, he devised a simple yet ingenious design. A small and lightweight plastic tripod and the pizza separator was born. Troglia obtained an international patent on his invention 50 years ago and it became an instant hit. But, he says, many others began using his design despite his exclusive right to it. The patent was never respected. I would go to pizzerias with just this gadget only to discover that the person who sold them the pizza box would also offer my invention. So it was more convenient for the pizza maker to buy everything from the same supplier. He didn't have the means to pursue legal action in Argentina and other parts of the world. And, Troglia says, he eventually grew frustrated and allowed the patent to lapse. Troglia's invention eventually made its way to the United States, where later a woman living in New York patented a pizza separator. Carmela Vitale in 1985 patented it as if it were her own. She submitted the patent with the identical design. Nowadays, Troglia owns a restaurant. And yes, pizza is on the menu. He marvels at how his modest invention has traversed the globe, even making a cameo at the 2014 Oscars. And while Troglia says he did not profit financially from the patent on his invention, his legacy remains. The only thing that I have left is the fame. For Gonzalo Bañez Villar, in Buenos Aires, Argentina, Veronica Villafañe, VOA News.